Hello? Hello? Oh, what the? We're gonna try your new tea. Tea out. Would you like some of this? Would you? Are you hungry? Let's pop it open. Hey, what's that? Do you want some of them? Take some of them. So here's the big test whether you'll actually eat it. A little bit of focus, but why are you not eating that one? No, you're eating it. Right, okay, so do you like that? We also have a little delivery here. Hee! It's maybe not that exciting, but we'll show you anyways. Key! Right, let's go get some food. So, I put 50 grams in the bowl. And it doesn't smell particularly nice, but I'm not eating it, but we'll see. There you go, fella. We'll check back in once he's done and see if he's ate it all, see if he's ate it at all. Any of it. Hopefully. We have a package, so let's dive in. So here's a stupid thing about the Max. They don't have a USB, an SD card reader, nothing. So currently, to get the clips from my camera onto my laptop, I have to put them into my old laptop, transfer them onto a external hard drive and transfer that to another external hard drive to transfer it onto my Mac. What a pain, what a time consuming thing. This will fix my problems, this will speed up uploading, so hopefully I'll be able to edit my videos quicker and get them out at a better time because I know you've been calling for them to be earlier during the day. So I'm going to try and this is going to help massively. So if you've ever dealt with Amazon as well, you'll know that you get free delivery for orders over £20. Now that cost me 19 99 so I needed something else to get my money up. Oh, you all done? Sorry to people. Did you eat all? We'll go and inspect in a second. Will you eat this other Go on. Okay, just chill there. He's in just in the corner. So yeah, I basically have to pay a £5 delivery. Oh, I forgot something for... Like a pound, I'd get free delivery. So, this is a car camera mount. Now, for like 3 99 I wasn't expecting much. But I was maybe expecting it in a box, not a bag. We'll see how it goes. We are going to my grandma's in about 5-10 minutes. So, I'll whap it in the car, see if it works. Because then when we go on our adventures, we can record. But that's it. We didn't get particularly much. It was just a little quick order. But... It will benefit the channel. So, doing it for you guys. What's that? Why haven't you ate it all? It is a lot bigger than his other kibble, but it weighed out the same, so... Are you just not hungry? Should we leave it there and see if you eat any when you come back? If not, maybe we have to put you on the wet food. We have got a wet food version. Because he's obviously been eating wet food and his diet's changed like three, four times within two weeks, which is no good. Although he's eating it again now. I think I just need to find the right angle. I think maybe doing it from the driver's side and going across the other way might be better. But what I'll do is I'll test out with me driving and talking and see how shaky it is when I watch it back. The problem is we live in the countryside, so the roads are horrendously bumpy. So I don't think I'll ever get it smooth, but this is what it is. Let's go fella. Okay, so this is probably the worst bit of road we're gonna be driving on. It's up and down. I don't know whether you can tell whether the camera's gonna just ride smoothly with it. I think the whole point most from this is that it doesn't fall off. I think that'd be the best thing. Pablo is sitting remarkably well in the car. He never ever just sits like this. This is unbelievable. The first time we get a camera in the car properly, and he's chill. We made it, and so did the camera. So this is what I get normally, but I get this when I'm driving, which is difficult to deal with. I like to put them in the boot, but that was the issue I was having the other day, which is why I went and looked at a different car, which I'm not getting. So, passenger seat, he should sit in the footwell, but 
he never stays there. Okay, so just to go back, because I didn't actually record or say any of this, Pablo's been on a wet diet. Now, I've just went and gave him a full meal of just kibble. Now, that was wrong. Nobody else should do that. If you're going to change his diet, you should kind of start mixing them together and slowly wean one off into the other. So, I went back. I think I left it where he'd only ate half. So, what I did was got some wet food, put it in there, mixed it all together, and he ate a lot. So, yeah, if you are going to change his diet, try to kind of mix them together and don't just stop and give him another one because it can upset his tummy. Which, I want to clarify that I did do that before any of you think I'm mistreating because I would forgot to do that, which was bad of me, which is why when he'd only ate half, something clicked in my head to tell me. Just going to do a few shots from like outside the front of the car just to see what it's like to see how much vibration is actually in this new tripod. So... So that's going to be it for today's video. So he's now on his new diet and we had him run around my grandma's house after his new tea and he was very lively. He hasn't looked this well in quite a while. Obviously he's, he was ill so he has been tottering a little bit but tonight he was back to full on pocket rocket mode. He was flying about. I haven't, I haven't seen him this excitable in a long time which is good. So as always please do like, um, comment, subscribe, share, do all the wonderful things because Pablo's liking all of his new subscribers aren't you? You're getting lots of nice comments. People love you. Yeah. Look at that face. Let me see people love. <sighs> Ready? Do the do the video ending. Ready? Do it. Go. Peace out.